All right, Brian, take us through your journey here at UNH. What's it been like being a Wildcat and playing for this community? Uh, you know, it's been fun. <clears throat> um, I've had to work real hard since the day I got here, um, competing with Radar and Dane early. Um, kind of earned a spot. My junior year, I was given a good opportunity. Um, Radar moved on, and I basically stepped into his role, and I think I took advantage of the opportunity, and ever since then, I've kind of taken off and uh, taken advantage of the opportunity and been successful. Absolutely. What sealed the deal for you to come here and play basketball at UNH? Uh, you know, I came on a visit and had a good time, really uh, bonded with the players and the coaches, and I thought this was a good spot for me, um, not too far from home, not too close to home, and so it was a good spot, a good fit for me. Yeah, have a lot of your family and friends from home been able to make it to any games? Uh, yeah, they've come to a lot of home games, and they come to a lot of road games in New York and stuff like that, Albany, Binghamton every year, which has been good. All right, when we talked to Coach Harry in midway through the season, he talked about one thing that you guys need to really improve on defensively was getting off the glass, second shots, rebounds. What have you been working on personally? What have you improved on this year that definitely has helped to the team's success? Yeah, I mean, rebounding is a big key uh, in defense. Obviously, we've stepped up our defense on the second half of the conference schedule. And I knew that I was going to have a big role on the glass last year. I was second in the league in rebounding. So I knew I was going to have a big target on my back, and we don't have a real big team. So I knew that was something I needed to focus on in the off season, and it's something I definitely worked on a lot, and I think it's paying off now. Mm -hmm, absolutely. You are also one of the four captains this year. What has it been like being a leader with this team, with this squad this year? It's been good. You know, um, I'm not really the most vocal guy on the team, but I try and lead by example, and it was a real honor to be named a captain. Mm -hmm. So just trying to embrace that and. It's been an honor. It's been fun working with all the guys. Yeah, and what's it been like playing with the other three seniors your whole career? Um, you know, Ryan and Alvin and also with the other captain, Chandler. Talk about what they're like to play with. You know, they all have been great. Um, obviously, I knew Chandler before. We played together in AAU, and we had a great relationship then, and we've become real close here. And, and Ryan um, was my roommate my freshman year, and we've grown real close over the years. The same thing with Alvin. Uh, we've gotten real tight even this year. Me and A have gotten real tight and stuff like that. So it's been a, a, a blast. It's been a, a pleasure to play with the, all three of them. You'll miss playing with them, I'm sure, after when you're done here. Yeah, definitely. I will. Yeah. I will. Now we have your last home game in Lundholm coming up. What's it been like playing in Lundholm for you over the past four years? You know, you've gotten pretty good fans here, pretty good support. You filled the gym pretty well. What's it like playing at Lundholm? Uh, it's been fun. Um, each year the, the crowds have gone up. Uh, attendance numbers are definitely rising. Um, the whiteout each year is fun at home. Get a good um, student section. All the TV games are good. Get a good student turnout. So it's been fun. It's not a big gym, but it's big enough. We get it packed in there. It's pretty loud. It's fun. All right, in May now, once you're done with school, what's the next step for you? Uh, after I graduate in May, I'm going to look for a teaching job uh, down in Virginia, teaching PE somewhere. Both my brothers are down there. And once my parents are able to retire, they'll probably follow me down there. Everyone will be down there. It will be nice.